Guys, welcome back to another episode of Med Going Medieval. I almost said it again. <laughs> it's going to take a while for me to actually get used to it, I think. Alright, so uh, today what we wanted to do was... That's a little bit loud. Uh, today what I want to do is basically work on... Um, basically the kitchen. Uh, we're going to need to upgrade this a little bit for the building. And I kind of need to start planning out... Um, where we're going to be bringing these stair stairs down. We should probably set up stairs so dogs and other animals can get down here because ladders are, well, one for one thing, very slow, but um, are also potentially a problem when animals can't go up them and stuff. So we're going to need to kind of plan out how far away we're going to need to actually make this uh, to bring it up and then we'll see what we can come up with but um because we have three blocks right here right so that should be enough for a ladder or a stair and then we'll need three additional blocks so about one two and then three so that's going to bring us right under that wall and then we're going to need one two and three so right about here is where we're gonna need to bring that down i think um we can break that up and i think all our settlers have beds now they should yeah i got them to build all the beds and stuff so every every settler has their own bed now uh we can sign that one for them just make sure they all have houses all right so that's good uh what we can do now is we can kind of clean up this room a little bit we'll uh, package that up and ship it outside and then we can start working on digging out this um, just so we have ooh, harvest ruined what is your skill level he's 16 he's already not exactly great but still something Okay, so I'm just waiting for somebody to basically mine that out, and then hopefully we'll be able to um, set up some stairs going down there. Uh, another thing that I want to check on... Yeah, we have plenty of wood, so that would be good. Uh, if we need to make any adjustments, then we will uh, to this. Uh, we might actually... Okay, well, it's autumn day two. Um... You know, let's uh, destroy that.
All right, so I ended up getting my settlers stuck down there, um, but I just managed to get them out. So uh, there was like this one, uh, what do you call it, like block that needed to be removed like from the ground there and they couldn't place it because there was that one like the stairs because it was in the way and stuff. So I did get the stairs all set up, at least uh, we'll have that ready. Now they can all leave and stuff. Uh, we'll set the... Oh, we got a new settler as well. Um, I'm going to actually set her bed over there and we'll set this to north. Hopefully she can move. She's unconscious right at the moment, but I'm sure we'll be able to uh, get her moved. Alright, uh, yeah, so basically we need another house then. <laughs> uh, it won't take too much time to actually uh, build another house. Uh, we should have the resources to do that, so uh, we just need to chop down a couple more trees, I think. But That one looks good, and we'll chop down a few more. Uh, that one, just so we have some extra wood. And let's see here. That one's mature now. That one's growing still. Growing, growing, mature. Growing. All right, so that should be good. There's another dead tree here we can remove. And um, once we get that all done uh, then what we can do is we can start building an, another house <laughs> uh, we have like four settler or five settlers now so um, figure what we'll do is we'll probably put it over on this side uh, yeah probably over here would probably be the best area to put it and just try and plan out you know paths and stuff like that so we have three blocks here if we do it like leave a spot right around here for walking it should be fine I think that would work and we could do something in that little area there all right so let's go ahead and start planning that out uh, we need some default stockpile so we can actually know what we're doing. All right, so I think it's like 11 long.
All right, so I got that house built, but we're running a little bit low on wood. So it's always a fight for wood, isn't it? Uh, we're going to chop down some more trees, and, or at least tell them to, and then we'll see if we can't uh, start planning out something a little bit different. Uh, we still need to get... Um, what do we need to work on? We need the kitchen done and a few other things uh like i want to get a few workstations set up as well like dedicated buildings for that i'm just going through the woods just see if there's any trees we can actually chop down oh, this used to be all forested and now it's just like just a few random trees here and there uh it's not for me cutting them down or anything like that it's just they ended up falling down due to the age, like the age over time. Um, but yeah, uh, we'll grab what we can from it and um, it's gonna be about a day for that one. It should be good, I think. Uh, our trees will take a while to grow, but uh, that one's growing. Yeah, I think that will be good. We'll see if we can't get one or two more trees. Ooh. Whoa. There's actually quite a bit of wolves, isn't there? We'll have a lot of hunting to do. <laughs> a lot of wolves. Holy stink. Alright. Um... Let's see here, we've got some dirt piles. I, I, I found some more clay over here, so I told them to harvest that up, bring it back. Uh, the dog's been going in and out, um, hauling some of it, but... Actually, where is the dog? Oh, there he is. He's moving over some of the junk piles now, so... I moved the uh, junk pile over here so we can start working on the house. Uh, we just have the um, flax left for growing and then we'll be able to start working on that. We'll probably need to figure out something for the, um, the cattle. Uh, I'm not sure what to do with it just yet. Uh, that would have actually been a perfect spot for it in that little area. Oh, speaking of which, I would probably have it all built down here now. Uh, let's go ahead and just reassign some of these things. So I want apple trees to go here. And Alright guys, so I started working on the, um, 
kitchen area. Uh, we needed to get rid of some of these uh, structures so that um, like the, the parts here so we can expand it this direction. Uh, I, it's about the same size as this one. I think it's actually the exact same size. So uh, I want more room than that uh, for the length and stuff. So what I'm going to tell them to do is basically expand it out a little, maybe two extra blocks, which means I have to rearrange the uh, side here, but that, that won't be too hard to uh, fix up. Uh, as far as lengthwise, um, we'll probably bring it out a little bit more, I think. Uh, maybe to this point around here-ish, just so it doesn't look a little bit awkward. But um, that will be important for um, upgrading the house. We're going to have dining up at the top here. Our cellar will be accessible through the kitchen, so it's easy to... Um, make food and stuff like that. We'll also have the kitchen on this side just because then we don't have it directly over our um, our storage. So that's really important to make sure the heat's distributed pretty good. And I figure if we have it, the kitchen over on this side for the hot parts, like the, uh, the butching table and stuff that can be over on that side, that's fine. But uh, things like the... Um, uh, the, the kitchen, like the stove, and all the other stuff, that should be over on this side of the house, just so it's, you know, situated better. We can have stairs going up to the dining room on, somewhere on this side, I guess. And then there will be, like, a whole huge dining hall up at the top here that they'll be able to eat and stuff. And uh, as far as storage, we'll probably build in storage a little bit as well, so we'll need to figure out how we're going to do that with... Um, the structures and stuff, but uh, at the moment I had to um, clear out this area, so I'm going to tell them to start moving some of this stuff over. we got quite a bit of clay now, so um, outside of that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.